so today we are going to uh, conduct a cat dissection. Um, and really this is to isolate the um, muscles in the cat. So in order to do this, there's certain equipment that is needed. First of all, protective equipment. So that includes lab coat, gloves, um, goggles. The fixative that's used to preserve these cats is toxic. And so um, having an area that is uh, ventilated and having that eye protection and um, skin protection is also very important. In terms of physical equipment, obviously the cat tray um, where the cat is going to be laying. Um, the utensils that will be used will be a, a blunt tipped large forceps, a probe, again blunt tipped scissors, as well as a scalpel. So in dissecting the cat you can notice that the skin has already been removed from the cat so at this level we're looking at the remaining connective tissue and we can even begin to see some underlying muscular tissue. So in order to really isolate the muscles, it's important to remove that connective tissue. And so the connective tissue that is really important to get rid of is the loose connective tissue. And in particular, the adipose tissue, which is the fat, as well as the areolar connective tissue, which is a loose connective tissue that is important in nourishing uh, the skin because it's highly vasculature. It has um, lots of va blood vessels and that is important because epithelial tissue does not have its own blood supply. 